Go. All right, so I'm gonna show you a couple ways to strengthen your shoulder blade muscles using a Swiss ball. Um, so you can either be on your knees with a pillow and you're gonna be horizontal to the ground. You can also come up on your toes if you want. Um, and then from here, we're gonna do four different movements. The first movement is gonna be an A. So your hands are gonna go up, the palms facing the ceiling, and you're gonna squeeze your shoulder blades together to bring those palms up towards the ceiling, and then relax. For all of these movements, you wanna make sure you're pinching your shoulder blades together in the back and not lifting up with your upper trap muscles. So keep that upper shoulder quiet, and then you're gonna squeeze from here, pull those shoulder blades together and relax. You're gonna do about 10 reps in this position. I'm also keeping my trunk stable. I'm not lifting with my spine. My head and my neck are staying still and just coming up and down. So that's the A exercise. The next position we're gonna do a T. So your palms are gonna go facing forwards. Your thumbs are up towards the ceiling and you're gonna do that same kind of shoulder blade pinch, making sure we're not tucking up into our ears. Our shoulder blades are staying nice and low. You're gonna squeeze and relax. We're gonna do that about 10 times. The third position is gonna be a Y. So you're gonna be at about 45 degrees and it's that same squeeze from that lower shoulder blade area. Just squeeze those shoulder blades together and relax. Make sure you're not using too much upper trap with this. This will get more challenging as your arms get higher. And then the last position is gonna be an I. So your arms are gonna be straight up in front of you, thumbs still towards the ceiling. You're gonna squeeze up and back down. Trying to use more of those lower shoulder blade muscles versus that upper trap. Right on the way. And about 10.